Before we leave, I just want to say something real quick. One thing I know for sure that I learned when I was in college. Music brings everybody together. Yeah. Yeah. Hey friends, so welcome back to another vlog. We are on our way to a Fulanito concert, y'all. You already know. All right, so we are here. This is where the concert is going to take place at. So I am here with hubby and my friends are already there. I'm just going to meet them. Y'all, my husband does not dance. He cannot dance to save his life. So I will be going and he just watched me dance, okay? <laughs> So I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Just relax and enjoy the music. I'll live on the sound as much as possible. You know, I don't want to wait to you on my tail. But anyway, enjoy and I will talk to you guys later.
so i hope you guys are enjoying this vlog so far if you were please give it a thumbs up you guys music and food has its own way of bringing different cultures together if you know me you know i'm all about um exploring different cultures i'm so open to a whole lot of things so yeah this is my happy place right here <laughs> let's get watching y'all i was so hot at this point oh my goodness Wait a minute, before we leave, I just want to say something real quick. I want to thank Sheila for bringing us. Julio for making that recommendation and make sure he got us here. Give it up for Julio. And Sheila, well, thank you very much for having us. But I want to say one thing before we walk away from here. It's been pretty tense in our country in the past year and a half. I don't like doing political statements, but I'm going to say this. There's one thing I know for sure that I learned when I was in college. Music brings everybody together. And when you have music out there, people are dancing and enjoying and starting a nice dialogue. Bottom line, that's all I got to say. You guys get home safe. Thanks for having us. Love you. God bless. Thank you, Springfield, so very much for coming out. To all the Zumba instructors, to all the Latino families who, like me, have been here for many, many years. People like my mother, who 30 years ago arrived and she hasn't had a chance to go back to Peru like she really has this. So the fact that we can bring it to Springfield, to bring it to the new generation, that's what it's about. Muchas gracias to the Levin Foundation, to the team, and of course, thank you to my beautiful mother, Rosa. Have a good night, everybody. Thank you for coming. If you want more of this, let Levitt know. Let, let Springfield Art Council know. Let the mayor know. Because this is our and more dancing. So, muchas gracias. Good night. Bye. We're going to have some autographs signed by Fumanito here. to we'll take a picture before we can take him back so we can change and go to the after party. In Georgia? Uh, yeah. I see people asking where. I like it. I'll be back.
so guys this is another day and as you can see i'm making some puff puff i'm going to visit um my husband and i are going to visit our brother here yeah he got the rest of the family visiting and of course you know mansa queen can go empty-handed so yeah i'm just making some puff puff it's the quickest thing you can make and almost everybody can enjoy including kids so it is always my go-to um snack so yeah this is it i just have a little more to go just a little more and this is what i've made already well wow, that looks so good it looks so perfect and it tastes so good yes i've tried one <laughs> why not this is the container i'm gonna take it in um i got it from home goods i believe uh, yeah it was from home goods and it's not even expensive it's really nice when you want to um take like a food gift snacks it's mostly for pastries and stuff you could keep anything in it and it has the the airtight lid it's very nice so of course i'm not going to close it now because i don't want it to get soggy um but yeah when i'm ready to go i'll just grab it close that and be on my way I hope you guys are enjoying this impromptu vlog. I just decided to pick my camera randomly. I'm actually using my phone to just record a few days in my life. And I hope you guys enjoy it. If you do, let me know. I think I'm getting more into the habit of just vlogging around, you know, just random. <laughs> but yeah, if you would like to see more vlogs, definitely let me know. I still got laundry up in there. I still need to put it in the dryer. But yeah, look at that, guys. So perfect. And I already have a puff puff recipe in my on my channel, uh, my cooking channel, Mansa Queen. If you would like to see exact measurements and how I do it, I follow my own recipe all the time. Like I legit have the recipe tattooed in my brain. I always, always use it. So if you're interested, I would leave the link in the description box. You can go ahead and check it out. So over here, I got, I baked some banana bread yesterday yeah it was yesterday I'm gonna open it guys look at that mm, 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 mm. I gotta get good lighting baby look at that oh yeah wonder why I can't lose weight baby <laughs> shade shade shady but yeah look at that again Mansa Queen your plug. I got my banana bread recipe. It's really nice and brown. It's not burnt. I use brown sugar. That's why I always get this perfect, perfect brown color. You gotta use brown sugar if you want that authentic looking, really brown um, banana bread. And you can see moist and decadent, rich, and all of the good things. I also got my loaf container from um, Home Goods, you guys. Home Goods. Home Goods is your plug. You can always, I'm always into home items. If you guys didn't know by now, I don't know what you know about Manta. Yeah, these are always handy. You could fit bread, any kind of loaf in there, air type, and to go. You know, it has the the rubber handles. You could just grab it and go. Really nice for gifting somebody. Well, not gifting the container. I take my container back. Okay, no shame in my game. <laughs> But yeah, that's my banana bread. Again, I will leave the link to my recipe in the description box. Hubby, um, hubby harvested some tomatoes. Um, was it yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. This was the leftover from my, yeah, this was the leftover from my fried green tomato recipe on my cooking channel. And hubby harvested these. I also have some ripe ones in the refrigerator. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's already 4.37, but I'm almost done. Yep. So I'll see you guys later um, when I'm going out and probably closing the um, the vlog. You keep talking to who? My, my pillow and my toothbrush. How do you talk to your pillow and your toothbrush? They don't answer? They don't answer? See, I'm okay. I'm sorry, I'm okay. Really? Yeah. Why do you want to be in my video? Say subscribe to mommy's channel. Subscribe to mommy's channel. <laughs> Alright guys, I am on my way out. We're actually all in the car. I got the kiddos with me. Um, I'm just wearing a, a romper. This is a one piece. And I have this really light um, kimono over it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, look at that song. It's giving me the glow, baby. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you like this vlog, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Um, if this is your first time on this channel and you like what you see, feel free to hit on that subscribe button, that red button down below. And also, while you're at it, hit on the notification bell. It would keep you updated. YouTube would send you notifications whenever I upload a new video. Until I catch you in my next one, y'all stay safe. I love you. Bye. Bye.